All righty, we are here. We Yay! are at Yellowstone National Yay! Park. We've been talking about coming to Yellowstone for years and years and years. So long. So long. It was just over a year ago, maybe 15, 16 months ago, that Melissa and I were here yep. with our good friends, the Pittmans. Yes, thank you, Alicia and Bob. And uh, we are here now with our kids in our RV and doing some RV boondock camping. Outside which, the north entrance of Yellowstone National Park. North entrance. So opposite of, of West Yellowstone, we're up on the north entrance. So you come through Billings and up Bozeman, that way. I Bozeman, think. I think it was. It was beautiful coming in. We'll, we'll give you some uh, B-roll of that at the end here maybe. But my goodness, what a beautiful RV camping so experience. Right now we're boondocked what 20 feet from the yellowstone river yeah it's so swollen we had to tell the kids be careful you can get swept down river but then we saw kayakers going by just a minute ago now the kids want to get the kayaks out and take them down the river yeah that's not gonna we, happen oh we're not not gonna happen not gonna happen no, maybe, maybe it is gonna happen i don't know and we are about what 10 minutes outside the park entrance uh -huh. at a campsite named cabrillo recreation site cabrillo recreation start which means free, free. Zero dollars, so we can stay up to 14 days uh -huh. here. Well, we're only going to stay a couple of nights, maybe two or three nights. Yep. And we're going to go in and drive in and see the park. What a beautiful spot, yes. though. A beautiful place to stay um, for your RV camping experience, your family experiences. This is the place to stay if you're looking so, at West Yellowstone. Or, uh, North, where are we? North Yellowstone, sorry. We found this campsite on Campendium. I think it was also on All Stays. But Campendium had a little more information for us. And some of the reviewers said that they were parked similar to where we are, right on the river. And they have water filters. So they have actually stayed longer because they get water out of the river and just filter it. And they can stay for up to 14 days. It's so beautiful right here. That's a heck of an idea because that is the most crystal clear water that I've seen. Um, I Don't mind the buffalo upstream. Yeah, the buffalo Fine. upstream. That's why you have a filter. But it was beautiful, beautiful <laughs> water. And for when you're RVing and looking for a place this is it this is is awesome now there's some other campsites around yep but the road coming in is nice gravel road there was a couple of potholes but nothing nothing terrible the road was great we did miss the entrance because we, I was looking at my phone and I think Clint was looking at his phone to follow the GPS coordinates that's the only complaint I had with Campendium so the GPS coordinates put us about 100 yards that way past a bridge and right to a T in the road. We thought we don't know which way to go. So we went down a road for a little while. It obviously was the wrong road. We turned around, came back, figured we're gonna have to find a different campsite altogether. We almost get to the main road, which is, I don't know, 100 feet that direction. And the kids are like, mom, isn't that the campground that we were looking for? And it was, the entrance is <laughs> immediately off the highway. Yeah. Um, it's beautiful. Take, Take a, a ride. ride off the highway immediate, <laughs> right? If you've made it to the big, scary looking bridge, Don't that's go a six ton it. bridge that my rig is almost too heavy to go across. We went across it and I got some cool video of that. We'll, uh, we'll show you here in a minute, but my goodness, if you make it to the bridge, turn around, you yep. haven't made it, haven't got that far. Yeah, it's right off the road. And we're going to check out the amenities. This is forest service land. So usually the amenities are not that awesome but we're going to show it to you one way or another so that you have the uh, best experience you can camping just outside of Yellowstone National Park so we'll go I think if we're down maybe I don't know 200 yards or 100 yards from the the toilet the other camp uh, reviews that I've seen uh, said that they were vault toilets we'll see what they are in a minute Okay, we're here at the the uh, restrooms. It is echoey in here, and it is a pit toilet. You always leave the lid shut so flies don't come in there. But it's clean, and there it's well stocked, so that's good. Um, so pit toilet. Bring your own hand sanitizer, right? We'll go grab some hand sanitizer from the There's these master box. locks on the toilet paper. Yeah, that's so that people don't steal the toilet paper because that's bad news bears. Okay, on the way to the um, Porta Johns, which they are vault pits, pit toilets, we found this really cool little boat ramp right here. And so we're gonna walk down here and check it out with you. So it looks like you can launch 
uh, boats down here. I don't know what kind of boats you'd take on this river. I guess it's a pretty big river. You could take lots of different ones. The kids have already asked me if we can get the kayaks out. Not sure if that's going to happen or not because it's a pretty swift river. And I don't know where I would get them out of the, of the water if we went in. I don't know where we'd pick them up. But there's a nice little boat ramp here. Takes you all the way down to the river. And... What a beautiful river. And we just pulled in. It, everything around here seemed like it was first come, first serve. So I wasn't super worried about getting a reservation. Um, it's been great. We loved it. Okay, awesome. So we'll, uh, we'll link to the GPS coordinates and some cool stuff that we use when we're boondocking in the description. We use uh, solar yeah, on I our roof. Our solar. And we have a Furman generator that we'll link to uh, one of those also. We have a fire pit that we use yep. to cook on. But and, it runs on propane, but it works even when you can't have a fire. Yep. So we'll link to those in the description.